The U.S. economy slammed on the brakes last month. A report from the Labor Department shows employers added just 18,000 jobs in June. That's even worse than the dismal numbers from the month before. Meanwhile, the unemployment rate rose to 9.2 percent. It's discouraging economic news adds another complication as President Barack Obama and congressional leaders try to make a deal to reduce the federal deficit, NPR Scott Horsley reports. It turns out that was no bump in the road the economy hit this spring. It was more like a concrete jersey barrier. Hiring came to a near standstill last month, with paltry gains in the private sector almost completely offset by layoffs in the government. There wasn't a scrap of good news in the Labor Department's report for President Obama to seize on. Our economy as a whole just isn't producing nearly enough jobs for everybody who's looking. The slowdown marks a turnaround. Earlier this year, employers were adding workers at a healthy clip of more than 200,000 each month. But since March, more than half a million people have joined the ranks of the unemployed, and the unemployment rate has jumped by four-tenths of a percent. 